Hello everyone and welcome back to Dead by Regrets or Regrets and the reason why I say that is because I'm not gonna lie I kind of retract everything I've been saying about this game's update like how I like I even said some extreme stuff that was really stupid of me saying like oh this entire update just needs to be uh reverted or like stuff like that it does not okay so quick uh thing I've been playing 20 matches of Survivor and 20 matches of killer so what i've learned from playing 20 matches of both sides is that dude I i'm sorry but this update has made this game so much better for both sides uh honestly so let me go over the survivor side because this is the biggest uh like i guess issue for other people right now in my experience as solo queue surviving my experience as survivor has uh it's been it just feels like it's been drastically increased and i've actually been having fun playing survivor because i mean the reason why i don't really upload much survivor videos is because survivor is kind of like tame or, or tame or like stale for me i and it's too slow for me to enjoy but these matches is like or like i mean i guess another thing could be like solo queue teammates i mean we know how those people are like solo queue teammates are an entire breed of people but so solo queue teammates have not been going down immediately and i can only think that this is indirectly because of dead hard being removed early game so survivors aren't doing like stupid plays i mean how many times have you played killer and a survivor just completely just gets decimated because they're like huh i'm gonna run into the killer i'm gonna i'm gonna fake a window from 20 feet away but i'm gonna run into the killer dead hard and he'll hit it and it just doesn't work and the survivor who actually could have used dead hard smartly could have extended the chase by two minutes decided to end it right now right another thing killers having their gen regression i know this is another huge issue uh killers having their gen regression completely like removed in terms of stacking i think this was a good change for solo queue because uh because the thing about solo queue there is a huge lack of communication and you could be the best survivor in the world but your team could crumble apart because of gen regression stacking if they don't know what they're doing this has made it so much bearable on survivors end. like when i was playing solo queue survivor it's just it's just been so much easier and i can just focus you know like not babysitting my teammates and for the 20 matches as killer dead hard not being in the game early game has made mind games a lot more satisfying rewarding and likewise gratifying so as killer you can do really high plays of mind gaming and you don't have to worry about the survivor going e and just completely nullifying your high level play when all they did was press a button at a pallet or a window in which the killer had to swing you know or lunge uh another thing uh as playing killer uh this is uh yes games have been going by quickly which i mean can be an issue on itself but i don't know like I've even had killer matches where I've lost and the game ended in like five minutes, but I've had fun. Like I've had fun because nothing, I didn't feel like anything was against me that much. Uh, like I felt like, cause I, I mean, obviously the games I lost that was me playing pig, but I mean, pig is kind of a killer own self. Like I actually did not feel like I lost because of something BS. I lost because either I'm just limited to how the killer is, or I just made so many mistakes that it's kind of too late for me to catch up, you know? So, uh, I'm gonna also going to put out the numbers out there just in case if anyone uh, has a question or a comment or a hate mail to follow up on it. Uh, my escape rate in those 20 matches, I think, was 80 or 85%. I, I can't remember how many matches I lost. It was either three or four. And by the way, escape rate, I counted escapes as in leaving an exigate or leaving the hatch after all gens were done. If I left the hatch because the killer killed everyone but me when there's like four three two or one gens remaining i did not count that so in my opinion those escape rates are pretty high but likewise uh it's the same thing for killer my the killers i played i played three matches as oni or four matches as oni and then i split 50 50 of the remaining matches as pig and trapper my average kill rate on oni probably not a surprise to some of you guys was a like 4k uh Oni is just incredibly powerful with the new heal changes and aura reading turns them into a monstrosity. Uh, Pig, this might not surprise anyone. My kill rate for Pig was 1 to 2k. I think this is incredibly fair in my opinion. 
The reason why I say this is because almost every single match as pig, or actually every single killer, an average of two to three survivors were running either a Comidius toolbox stacked with either repairing speed or charges, or those toolboxes were just toolboxes with brand new parts. Honestly, if pig, if my average as pig was a three to four K against teams that were running on average three toolboxes could be brand new part or the other powerful version i think that would be kind of messed up if i got a 3k or 4k on average during that that would mean that pig would statistically would need a nerf but we don't want that uh and all the other items either the survivors were empty-handed or they just had med kits but in my opinion med kits are perfectly fine how they are now and then for the other killer i said was trapper could be a surprise could not be a surprise my average kill rate as trapper was a three to four k uh i don't want to boast or fillet myself but i think i've mastered trapper all you have to do or all i need on trapper is just two minutes to set up traps around my map and i am perfectly golden like it, snowball is imminent there and yeah again ask me any questions i don't care if it's like a question i don't care if it's hate uh, if you just want to know how my experience with these 20 matches are like, uh, if you want to know if the community was actually, you know, kind of being over exaggerating over this update, I'll let you know. And yeah, and then to the build, I know, sorry, it's been a long talk. To the build, uh, basically dead hard, you need to safely unhook a survivor. Pyramid Head has a interesting hooking uh, mechanic where he doesn't have to hook survivors. If you are able to inflict, uh, afflict trails on the survivors and make them tormented you can send them to like this cage the reason why pyramid head is a tier in my opinion is because his cage nullifies every single strong second chance perk that has to do with hooking and now dead hard is in that category pyramid head if you play pyramid head right or like uses trails as like trapper traps as pyramid head you can like once you have your power bang when the sword hits the ground let go of your power you will put a really hard to see trail that survivors will actually trigger when they run over. So if you put them around like trapper traps in the middle of pallets, survivors are going to have to run through it. And yeah, and survivors uh, save each other from the cage. Dead hard will not even activate. And that's a really good thing. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. And here's my build. And here are my add-ons. And I'm hungry, so I'm going to get some survivor pudding. And let's see how this is. Sorry, I, I recorded these matches two, uh, two days ago. I don't remember how they went, so enjoy oh dude it's not fractured cow shed i want fractured cow shed <laughs> again not sarcastic i feel like every time i say something like that i have to say i'm not being sarcastic i actually really like fractured cow shed it's because it's challenging like chasing wise i don't have corn hub premium so i can't really see through the corn that well but that one is not sarcasm either i really do not have corn hub yeah. Uh, one good try is Pyramid Put, like, Trapper Traps around. I've not been doing that last match because I just forget. Because I'm garbage. Boner. You'll win a boner. Make it look like I'm still committing. Yeah, did you see his shadow? He's warning it long to see if I'm mind gaming. And now I'm going to mind game for real. This looks like a short, uh, long window, actually. Uh, did he just go all the way back? I don't know where he is. Oh, there you are. Really good, but I kind of have you dead zone. No, I don't actually. Uh, pallets on his side. Okay, you're not the obsession, so I'm fine wailing on you. Run into my goulash. What the hell was that audio aim? It just deleted my lunge. Oh my god, dude. Why are, why are ace players like the best people in the entire game? I don't get it. Nice. Oh, yeah, you see what happened if I chased that guy? This gem would have been done immediately. Oh, minus 10%. Epic. Okay, you're not the obsession. That's good. Oh, never mind. Another gen got done anyway. Rip. Okay, that was that far one. That's fine. A survivor easily could have just wiggled right through there. Okay, there wasn't even a pallet there, but how did you dodge that? Who are you? Oh. Okay, you're not the obsession. This is fine. I just want to farm stacks until, like, my stacks get to the point where I'm pretty much farming hits. No basement, so I can do that. Ooh. Ah. Uh, <laughs> nice. 
Okay, I don't hear the gen progress over there, so I don't know about a flashlight in that direction. I don't even know if anyone's even running a flashlight. I was not paying attention. I need to start paying attention because I really don't. They're healing though, which is really good. I can only assume that they're healing at the booner spot. Oh, definitely. See how fast they're healing? That's a booner. Yo, win a booner. Probably around cow tree, right? Would be the area they're doing it at. Uh, maybe not actually. Not the head start. All right, let's go after you. You seem like you're a wannabe juicer. I mean, that's kind of Nia's, right? I don't know how that missed. Wait, she ran it like so wide. Oh, okay. Well, never mind. Well, I mean, she did. You saw the scratch marks. Corner and shoot. Yeah. Then I'm going for a hit. She'll play it safe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Nice. That was perfectly executed by me. I knew she was going to fake it. Nice, dude. We are destroying dead hard. Counter to dead hard. I didn't even uh, cage the other guy. Boner. Boner. Hey. I think I want to go back to the middle area. That seem, that place seems really friendly. I'll chase you unless you're running to that corner. Okay, there's no point in chasing him. You see how far he's running? Absolutely no point. That will be a losing chase. Don't chase survivors at a spot where there's no generator. Who is he? It can't be you. Wait, are, are, is him in Ohio the same outfit? Maybe he won't want that. Yeah, he thought I had range add-ons. Okay, he's the obsession. We want to hit him with that power. We're going to go all the way back to Ace. We want to push him the other side. We don't want him to run to the right. He probably will anyway. Nice. He keeps missing a skill check every single time that happens. He's going to run it long. Yeah. I I know I cannot have hit them. I cannot have hit him there. Dude, that was really good. I got it. I got a gulag with your name on it, soldier. No. Dude, this guy is so good. He's so good. Oh, yeah. I, yeah, I kind of figured. I figured you run to the left because of the human brain psychology. And if you're in a... If the if the right side of, like, your running area is corralled on the, on the right, you're more likely to just go left. Dude, not the obsession, man. No. I'm getting juiced by the obsession by a propeller. I'm getting juiced by Balloon Boy from FNAF. What the hell is this game? You got it looks like where is the other person at oh dude i don't have corner premium for this shite oh there you are how did that hit her how did that hit her get off that you're the one i want to hit there we go dude i i, I must suck Ball was going for hits like that for some reason. The other person got picked up immediately. Let's go. Nice. They're healing on the pallet. That was a quick. Oh, yeah, Booner. Where are you at? There you are. Oh, wow. Dude, you got healed so quickly. What a gamer. What a god. She's going to live into Cow Tree. She's not. Okay, that's fine. Want to try it again? Do you think that's an exponential moon over there? It could be. So this girl has a flashlight, it seems. Either that's exponential or like someone's just always there. Okay, it's a it's not exponential because white. For some oh my god, get out of there! <laughs> what is he, what are you doing? That was the obsession I downed too. Let's go. Flawless victory. There we go. Time that as fast as I can. Yeah, they're rowdy. They're rowdy like a belly button. Get out of here. Ooh. Oh my god, guys. I actually waited out a dead heart. It is exponential. Wait, it's totally exponential. Unless that was unbreakable. Bro, it was... Dude, it looked like he vaulted that so quickly. Nice, dude. He played that amazingly. Get on you. Oh, that... Uh, I mean... Yeah, good luck playing a TNL against a pyramid where my entire power counters windows. You don't have balance landing. I saw you sprint burst away. 
He made no. S oh, because he went off the ledge like that. Okay. Oh, dude. Here, here's, here's when the, here's where we start cooking with Gazel. Cooking with gas. Rawr, rawr, rawr. <laughs> I get like power struggled right there. So I'm gonna leave this boon up because it's actually kind of fun, letting them get like so many heals and I just shred them with this perk. Save the best for last. All right. All right. Time to activate Corn of Premium so I can see someone. Okay, they're not even around here. They're not around here. No survivors around here. I'm gonna go back to the hook because they're all gonna start healing up and maybe like pile like dog pile on top of the hook maybe. Someone's right here. You see that bro flew up like arbitrarily. Ooh, you're kind of far away. I mean, I guess it's worth chasing you, right? I think so. I got range. Don't pre-drop it. Don't pre, dude. Don't pre. Nice. I thought you would dodge it. Oh, God, dude. I hate, I hate these types of players that just run it so long. I mean, that's how you do it. Dead hard. Dude, can you imagine if she actually had dead hard and she was just thinking I would wait it out? That Dwight is probably like, oh, someone's right behind. That Dwight, who I waited the dead hour out, is probably so confused on why I waited it out, right? But I mean, think about it. Like, I had nothing to lose. Oh my god, Balloon Boy. Balloon Boy moment. He's running it long, I think. Yeah, dude, he's running that long and hard. So long and hard. Free drop. On sliding. Oh my god, that was legendary. I <laughs> dang it. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna wall hack the hell out of you. You ready? <laughs> Epic. Nice, dude. But you guys are falling. You guys are dropping like flies, though. Fish in a barrel moment. Oh, my. Dude, this guy is literally just flexing on me. Like, you see how he vaulted that? He, he fast vaulted it from walking. I'm mind gaming. Oh. Oh. Oh, he played that really good, actually. Wait, 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 wait. Was he about the dead hard? It looked like he was literally about the dead hard. Like, it looked like he was about to, like, lean down and steal my wallet. Interesting. Sorry, Hexo Ohio. Why did I have, like, a, a hernia trying to say that? Sorry, guys. I'm just mentally slow sometimes. Bro, I saw that propeller hat just, like, fly right off on top of your head. Where's the ace? This guy, like, ace is a literally juicer. He's here somewhere. I hear him. Oh, not the juicer. He's gonna try to vault it. Nice. Paranoia from Pyramid Head's uh, M2 attack. He's gonna use Corn Hub Premium to my disadvantage. The Dwight. The Dwight. The propeller hat is flying. Oh, God, he ran away. I was gonna try to snipe him or something. There's not a pallet back here. Dude, this guy is like good. Like, he's good. Like, you can't mind game him over anything. He's just amazing. You're so good. Dead hard. Oh. Oh, wait, no. Don't you have sprint burst? I don't remember. Bro, Ace, you gotta pull your pants up, man. The Entity Realm don't like that. Well, I mean, Entity Realm also made the most recent. It's not the most recent Skull Merchant skin anymore, but I mean, you guys know what I'm talking about. The, the supposedly carbon fiber movement enhancements. Yeah, into the realm. That's totally for the enhancements. Someone tap this generator. Uh, hey. All right, take me away. All right, just don't go flying in the air with your dumb propeller hat. Oh, why did you? Oh, I was about to say, why did you slow vault that? But he had no control over that. He just didn't fast vault it. I thought he was like stealth vaulting it, and that's why I hit him. Because the hitbox still goes out. The hitbox is the exact same as if the killer uh, was like, if I just M1 over that. That's the hitbox is the exact same. It's when he falls on the ground is when the hitbox uh, follows the survivor. And by daylight tips, well, I guess pyramid head tips. Actually, no, it's dead by daylight tips because almost every single thing in the entire game has that exact coding with hitboxes. Yeah, so like every time you see someone's like, oh, Hunter's hitboxes suck. It's not Hunter's hitboxes. 
every single killer has the same exact hitbox. Huntress just makes it more blatantly obvious that the hitboxes just aren't connected to the model. That if you catch my Jizzity Jam. Do you elaborate a little bit more on those matches as killer and survivor? Okay, so my... Okay, 20 matches as survivor. My kill rate... Or uh, kill rate. My survive rate of escape... My escape rate was 80 to 90%. And by escape rate, I do not mean, like, last man standing patches. I did not count that. For escape rate, I counted all the gens being done, and I get out by the exit gate or the hatch. That's what I counted. <laughs> Sorry, man. Oh, not the 360 inside my rectum tech. Nice. Oh, I thought that was the obsession I hit. Oh, that's not good, then. Nice, I got wall hacks, son. Here my head, wall hacks. And as killer, I played three different killers. That was a really good dodge, by the way. And those three different killers. Dude, that was amazing. She faked going to the left and went to the right instead. I played Oni, Pig, and Trapper. And I think out of all of the killer matches, I think on average. Oh, I did that so close. On average, it was a. Uh, I think three brand new parts per game. And if not brand new parts, and then there were med kits instead. That's how it pretty much it was. God, why am I chasing my obsession like a headless chicken? This is not good. I knew you were going to go for that. I did that exact same fake as Survivor. She's smart looping this because I can't use my power here. She's going to go to that one now. Ooh, dude, that's a gen done with Corrupt and Deadlog, by the way. Dude, this person's juicing me. I kind of want to keep chasing her, though, because she's really fun to play. Even though my power is pretty much useless here. There we go. Yeah, that still hits because of the hitboxes. We get our first tournament, uh, so if whoever goes for the save does not get dead hard. So, yeah, the other people who weren't running brand new parts... Actually, even not brand new parts. There's just toolboxes, like Comedius ones. And then they would be running, uh, what's it called? Uh, medkits, which I don't blame. Uh, I'm fine with medkits now. Uh, hey, what's up? Windows on this side. You can't run up there. And, okay, so my average kill rate on Oni, it's probably not, it's probably really obvious. It's a 4k. I think every single Oni match, I got a 4k. But every single piggy match, I got a, uh, what's it called? Uh, my average was a 1 to 2k. Which, I mean, to be fair, I think that's perfectly fine. Because if I got an average of a 3k to 4k as Pigu against brand new parts and medkits, that would prove that this that, that something is wrong. I should not get a 4k with a killer switch is weak like that on average. Trapper is kind of different. Trapper, I actually think, is worse than Pig. But I feel like I've mastered Trapper. So because of that, believe it or not, uh, my average on Trapper was 3 to 4k. Despite the brand new parts. I mean, the reason is, is because Trapper, all, like, average, the, all four of the gens went in, like, two minutes. But, like, I'm, as Trapper, I'm used to that. Did you dead hard? Bro, 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 bro. The Rock Man. Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Right, let's see if I can get, like, a hit or something here. Just a little bit of taste. Just something. Okay, no, they're gone. Yeah, that's pretty much how the matches went. Oh, no, dude. You're, you're standing by Patrick's Rock, Mighty. Just call me Finn. I started watching, like, Spooky Loops recently, and he calls Leon full cut, and I just cannot unsee it. I just cannot unsee it. It's kind of funny. I don't know why. It just is. Uh, is that blood on the ground? I don't know. Did they run to this? They did run over here. I can get another nowhere to hide. Right here. Really good. Okay. Uh-oh. I am surprised she did not see my red light through the wall because you actually can see it through there. It, you, like, it, you, the, red, the red light doesn't go all the way, but you can see it, like, up against, like, the wall. Like, you can see, like, a tiny bit of, like, the... the, 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 the I was going to say the shrinkage. That doesn't make any sense in context. Was someone over there? Like, you can just, you can just see the light. Boom. Boom, boom. 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 Pretend I'm going this way. Oh my god, I did not know you were in there. Jesus Christ, I was going to go after the bowl cut. Okay, it's still sparking. I was just checking and see if I can use that as like a farm balance. No. Ooh, you get the stagger and save the best for last. You don't really make it too far. And I know... Wait, you could have saved David, actually. You could have dead art. You're going to do it to me? 
Dude, he's trying to rob me of my stacks, man. No bueno. Alright, let's drop here with our huge cankles of Pyramid Head. Yeah, see, these gens, in my opinion, are normal. Like, this is normal. Barrel. I am making a lot of mistakes, so there's also that. That gen's... Oh, oh, that one got done? Really? Hold on, let me do a quick drive-by of my huge, long sword. Ah, I knew someone would go on here after I was done checking. Ada, what's up? That was a really good maneuver. Does someone have any means necessary? Oh, no, that's that pallet over there. Oh, dude, this pallet's gone. What am I thinking? Anyone want to body block this girl? Please. Oh, don't go up there. Oh, we got we got Nancy to the Sabo rescue and maybe body block. She's going to try to go this way to take the body block. Ah, dude, I am four Pearl Universes ahead of you. Wait, wait, wait. You're here. Leon's here as well. So I'm going to hit her. I should be able to get my stack from Leon now. She's going to... Wait, wait. She's going to try to Sabo this. Oh, wait. The trailers aren't going to stay there. She's going to go Sabo the hook, right? Yeah, well, he is. Wait, are you dead? I have no idea. I'm sorry if you are. My bad. Oh, I got six hooks. That's fine. I've at least took everyone one, so that's okay. I didn't realize she was dead. I thought it was... Oh my god, dude. I was about to say, I thought it was David that's dead. David is definitely not the one dead. Actually, it would be more inclined to be you, but I don't think you're hit either. Really smart. Ooh, you probably should not run that far out. If if she would have seen... I would have not have went for the hit. The reason why is because basement. You can't shoot over basement. I, I, she must have not have noticed that. Oh, God. She's going to juice me on this area again. Window? Oh, man. Dude, I think she can... I am confident that she can loot me for an entire gen right there. That is... You can, like, it's so hard to play that as Pyramid Head. I'm pretty much just an M1 killer. No progress. Or, same progress. All right. Zero. All right, let's go back to this three gen area. Yeah, that sounds about... Yeah, see, like, this gen would have gotten done. I would have been at a complete losing point if I committed to that. Nice. Audio's gonna cut, though. All right, I catch up to you pretty much instant instantaneously. Instantaneously. You don't make that. Nice. All right, pick him up. I'm gonna put him on a glorious meat hook. Right here. We can go towards that generator. No power struggle, please. Thank you. Yeah, Nancy has a toolbox. I don't think it's a Saba one. I think it's just a Gen one. But that's the thing. Oh, really? That's weird. I thought you were in the locker for a second. I'm going to keep putting my knife on the ground so it makes her think I have range add-ons. Okay, this pallet's gone. Remember that? This pallet is still up over to the right. But she's going to run towards... Nice, that's the obsession, too. Nice. The other guy, I can only assume, is going for the save, right? And then we'll go kick the other gen. Yeah, someone for sure. So, I'm, I'm going to guess that David is going to go for the save, and Leon is going to go for the generator, because he's fully healed. They can do, like, an adrenaline play or something cute, right? Let's pretend we do not know he's here. Find him. Oh, 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 I got stuck. Okay, no sprint burst. I don't think I've seen anyone's exhaustion perk. Make him bob and weave a bit. Lose distance. Pallet here. Okay, there is. I saw David. Alright, let's end this. Oh, David. Man's running a marathon. He's gonna be trail tormented. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just kind of wanted the match done. I don't think you guys... After the pressure I just got right there, I don't think you guys really had a chance. Sorry. Man, playing this guy is kind of satisfying. Yeah, like, I, like let's say if all four survivors have dead hard. I think I probably, because I, I wasn't so good on the Trail of Torment, I think I probably would have experienced it, like, once or twice? Once or twice? I have no idea. Yeah, out of all the games I played, this is this was probably the easiest one. But again, uh, every time, I mean, there's a reason for that. Every time mid-chapter comes out, the buffer in MMR, for some reason, gets, like, kill switch for, like, a little bit. So, because of that, the MMR right now for Pyramid Head is just what the game normally is but for the mmr for the killers i usually play trapper pig oni uh the mmr i'm going to be going against people who are actually my skill level which is fun for me but i mean 
I think I think MMR is fine where it is now, where it's just like a buffered at 1600. So and six and since 1600 is a pretty easy number to get to, uh, MMR doesn't dictate so much on what survivors go up against. So every time you see someone in an argument that's like, "But I'm in high MMR," so this don't listen to them. It's not entirely true. It's not as black and white as that. High MMR is 1600. If you don't know how the numbers work in this game, 1600 is really a, it's an easy number to get to. Like, if you played this game for one full day as a noob player and you lost like one to two matches, you would get there immediately. So, don't don't always take those people to heart. 